Six. Seven. Today, I'm going to take you on a thrilling journey exploring the history and characteristics of the Basset Hound. I have had two Basset Hounds of my own, so I have a lot of first-hand experiences with this breed. I'm sure we've all seen a Basset Hound around your neighborhood or at the park. I know when I'm walking my Basset, I am oftentimes stopped and asked questions just because they're such a curious breed. So today, I would like to share with you some of the history and characteristics of the Basset Hound. Basset Hounds have been known throughout history of having very unique characteristics, such as their keen sense of smell, their long ears, and their long bodies with short legs. Basset Hounds have always been known to have a very keen sense of smell. Basset Hound's sense of smell is just second to that of the Bloodhound. Basset hounds make excellent hunters because of their sense of smell. Unfortunately, though, a basset hound can get so focused on a scent that it is tracking that it can become lost. Basset hounds have also been known for their long ears. The long ears of the basset hound help make them a good hunter because as they are tracking, their long ears drag on the ground, picking up scents. These long ears, unfortunately, have been known to get stuck in the water dish and then leaving me a nice wet mess on my kitchen floor. Basset hounds are also known for their long bodies and their short legs. This body style makes it easier to follow on foot while tracking in dense cover while hunting. Unfortunately though, this can also lead to back and hip issues, especially if your basset hound is overweight, so it's very important to give your basset exercise daily. Another characteristic of the Basset Hound is they make great pets, which I would definitely have to agree with. Basset Hounds have a very tolerable disposition. Basset Hounds are very kid friendly and they're very affectionate towards their family. Basset Hounds are very tolerable with other dogs and other animals in general. Basset Hounds are also very friendly towards strangers, so they probably wouldn't make the best guard dog. Basset hounds are also known to be very lazy. The basset hound is very calm while inside. Because of this calm manner, it needs regular exercise to avoid obesity. Just as the basset hound has so many wonderful qualities, it has so, some not so wonderful qualities as well. Basset hounds have been known to be stubborn, which I can definitely agree with. The Basset Hound can be very dip difficult to train because of this stubbornness. House training a Basset Puppy is also a challenge due to their stubbornness. Basset Hounds also have a very unique and loud voice. The Basset Hound generally growls or bays instead of barking. Basset Hounds also have a very unique whine that they use when they are seeking attention or begging for something. <clears throat> Basset hounds have also been known to drool excessively. Drooling is one of the primary reasons why basset hounds are put up for adoption. Because the basset hound has loose skin around its mouth, they oftentimes make a mess while drinking. As you can see, a basset hound has many great characteristics and can make a wonderful pet. I've shared with you some of the following things. Basset hounds have been known throughout history of having unique characteristics such as their sense of smell, their long ears, and their body style. They can also make great pets, but they do tend to have some undesirable characteristics as well. And now I would like to introduce you to the stars of the show. Here are my Basset Hounds. This is Sam, who unfortunately passed away from cancer a few years ago, my first Basset. And this is Truman, who ironically is three years old today. And here's one, it just shows how tolerable they can be after my kids decided to dress him up. And I can also tell you, even though he's very tolerable, he is very stubborn as well. Thank you so much.